The Fishery Lane Juvenile Hurdle is the final race from here at Nace. And it's for four-year-olds, of course. This is four-year-old Juvenile Hurdlers. And it's listed and it's over two miles. And the top one is Red Point for Darren Thompson. Three wins out of four for that one. Royal Portrait, Jim Murray. It's also got Arcadian, Bold Highlander for Martin Leedham. Bonfire, Schwill for Dan Hughes. Far Away Hyde, Thomas Rogers. More of the same. Joshua Sutherland, Wait and See, Craig Beckwith, Al Masahiva. Thomas Rogers, Classy David Hooley, Crusading Baranka, Craig Allen, Jailbreak, Leon Van Rensburg, Littlecoat, Grand Derek Hinton, Newlands, Paul Rhodes, Paperweight Finder, David Robertson, and Stirred Not Shaken, Ryan Tamasevi. 16 of the men called in, and away they go, making their way towards the first flight. Uh, big field for this one, and Bonfire Schwill in the blue is the early leader. Missing down towards the first of 10 flights because they have to negotiate quite a lot of flights out for a two mile hurdle. 10, normally see about eight, and it's Bonfire Schwilt who's got the lead by about three. And I'm sure the trainer will be hoping that one cuts across to the fence at some point, gets over the second quite nicely as well. Classy is the one who's just struggling towards the back with stirred, not shaken, also nearer the back than the front. But Bonfire Schwill has now got to the fence as the fence momentarily disappears, and Bonfire Schwill is clear by a good seven lengths and putting the pace to the race and well clear with a big clump of them sharing second red point three times a winner lost his unbeaten record last week we try to bounce back today and there's a four at the back there wait and see has gone so we don't need to wait and see what that one's going to do because we already know it's out of the race they get over number four and bonfire schwilt leads by about six to more of the same in second arcadian in the black and red is third with two of these Staying quite wide on the track. Classy is just rolling around a little bit as well in mid div as they make their way round this turn and head out onto the back straight. And Bonfire Schwill is the leader. The lead is down to about four or five now, with Newlands just poked his head into second. Then Red Point Paperweight Finder is also close up on Al Masahiva as well, with Jim Murray's Arcadian getting closer as well as they get over number five which they're all safely over and the leader just being given the hurry up now to stay clear he's only probably about a length and a half up now the angle's a little bit deceptive you can see red points now cutting across to the rail that seems to be the point where the horses decide to cut across royal portrait is also coming across as well and he's been chased by his stable mate arcadian jailbreak is after that one they come down to the sixth and over that one they go and now bonfire Schwill is about to be swallowed up i think by red point and royal portrait the gray coming around the outside is crusading baranka also coming through there now is newlands trying to give Paul Rhodes a quick one two here, but it's Red Point in the lead. Bonfire Schwill. Red point, red point on the outside. Bonfire Schwill is still trying to fight back. Newlands is there. Royal Portrait. Cruzes and Baranka. There's plenty in with chances. The two Jim Murray horses are right well in there as well. And they're coming down towards the next flight. And over that one they go. And oh, there's a mistake there by Bonfire Schwill. And Red Point is clear in the lead now, just about on the inside, but up the centre of the track. Crusade in Baranka has got a share of it. Coming around the outside, going really well. He's bold Highlander, but jumped that really slowly. That was the eighth. They've got two more to take and Red Point's got the inside and that's a big advantage of a, at least a length and a half there. Crusading Baranka now challenging in second up the centre of the track. Shake and not stirred. He's trying to get into it as well. After that one is Jailbreak also getting a first mention but it's Crusading Baranka. Red Point stirred not shaken. Jailbreak and Newlands Bold Islander trying to run on again. So too's Paperweight Finder over the second last they go and Red Point being pushed into the lead. Red Point in front from Shasta Shirt not staking. Then comes Crusading Baranka there over the final fly then and it's Red Point in front Red Point from Crusade in Baranka these two being chased by Jailbreak but it's Red Point in the lead is he back to winning ways this week Red Point from Crusade in Baranka Red Point needs a line it's close Ooh, it's close Red Point was being eased by the jockey and I think it's held on with a flashing grey head of Crusade in Baranka didn't quite get there but Took a bit of a risk, the jockey on Red Point, but Red Point, it's three out of four, is it? No, it's four out of five, I think, for that one then now. Red Point for Darren Thompson, the winner. Crusade in Baranka for Craig Allen, second. Jailbreak for Leon Van Rensburg was third. More of the same. Joshua Sutherland, fourth. And Paperweight Finder for David Robertson was fifth.